Oh my goodness, look at all these mass jotters I found. That is too many. There's about eight in there. What? I've got such a cringe on my face. Hey guys, it's Danger Debs and I'm home in Inverness. I've been here since New Year's Eve, came here for New Year, and now I'm leaving two hours, go back to Glasgow. This wasn't planned at all, I just came home because I felt sick, I needed to live in a warm house, and I just went to see my parents, and they were so excited to see me. So I came home, and my dad just jumped for joy. I'm so glad I came home and surprised them, it was really nice. I must say, if I was home in Glasgow, I would have been in a cold flat, and I would have been still sick today. I've got a cold still, and I can't sing, but I can kind of talk. And I want to talk about what I found in my childhood room here in Inverness. I found my old school books. I went to school back in 1999 up to 2013. And I want to show you all the school books I had back at that time. When I was in Coldine Primary School, Downey Primary and Inverness Royal Academy. So here are some books that I found when I was back at school. Uh, the first one is my biology book. And here I learned Biology Intermediate 1, which I did not pass in 3rd year or 4th year or 5th year. I tried and I failed, so that was terrible. But I loved learning about the health triangle, uh, growing plants, there's so much I did. I loved drawing uh, everything that I learned from Biology Intermediate 1 with Mrs. Rathbun. She was a great teacher ever. Uh, I learned about lungs, smoking. My teacher loved me, but I didn't pass at all. So let me try it again and again and again, but I didn't pass. But I enjoyed learning biology and intermediate one. It was fun. I even tried to test myself by using this little thing. And I don't think I'm good at biology still. So, um, let's try. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three. Uh. Name different types of milks. Uh, UH, U... U H I semi skim. There's six types. U oh U H T semi skin skimmed and there's other ones. My next school book I found is my R E books, my religion books, where I learned it in S five I think. I'm not sure. It's where I learned about the Bible, Christianity. I can't remember. What what I learned from that class is in these books. And I didn't pass that class too. A lot of us dropped it because the exam was just naff. I mean, you got to answer these questions and give so many sentences. And one of my friends took the exam and he gave all his answers on nine pages. I just did four. I think it's terrible. You can't give your own opinion. You have to give a scientist's opinion or whatever's from the Bible. I do believe in God, but... Seriously, I do not like the exam. I don't. Next school book I found was all these maths books. I like maths. I like how I made this uh, maths book. Because I talked about adding at the start. Then I went to divide. Then talked about how the clock works. Then millimetres. And then I went into angles. Then times bread. Uh, charts. Pie chart. Angles. A percentage. I talked about all that. I've got all my examples from like different maths books. Thanks to Miss Lane, who was my teacher, who is now the head of the department at Evans Royal Academy. Very proud of her. She was a favourite teacher ever in maths. Oh my goodness. Look at all the books I did with her. I mean, there are uh, math teachers I have, but I have like eight jotters in here. Oh my goodness, seriously. Wow. It even tells me like what room I was in back in the school. Oh my goodness, it even tells me like what class I was in and what day with what teacher. Um this one says uh room twelve, Monday, Friday, Mr. Davison, room eleven, Tuesday with Mrs. Young, Hut Hut sixty six, Wednesday and Thursday, Miss is Brady. I remember that teacher, Mrs. Brady. She was the head of the school but slash uh maths teacher. She's my favourite, plus Mrs. Lane. Oh my goodness, so many math jotters in there. Uh, next, oh, wait a minute, this ain't a school book, this is a college book. This is everything from acting, this is my acting book from college. Monologues, poem of the night's meal. Oh my goodness, that's a lot right. A view from the bridge, that's just like a little research, just a view of the bridge. 
That's a lot. What is this one? Romeo and Juliet. I remember doing that. I had to be Juliet saying, Romeo, Romeo, wherefore thou Romeo? <sighs> I never had to do that. I was like sitting on a chair backwards and just seeing it from like a balcony. I'm trying to be Juliet. Oh, Romeo, Romeo, wherefore thou Romeo? Good times, good times. I loved acting. Out of the Darkness Future Company. Love you guys. Okay, next one. Oh, another one from college. H&C Childcare Practice. Um, I only did that college course for four months. It's really, really hard. They change the course every three years. I wish they didn't, seriously. Um, so here we got play, learning, and development. Leadership start with me. Um, nursery staff information. That's when I was doing a nursery placement. Back at the college, which is really good, you got to do that for two days within the week you still did college. A bit more here. Play. Week three, Tuesday mornings. That's a lot of work. I mean, I missed a lot of classes because I left the course after four months. It was really hard. I wasn't the only person. Even a lot more stuff in here. Play. Getting it right for every child. It's a long journey, I'm going to say an hour and a half to get to Elgin every morning from Inverness. What's this one? Okay, I know it's got Star Wars on it, but I know what it is. It's not about Star Wars. It's about me learning about intermediate one of childcare. This is my favourite childcare ever because I passed it. It was such a good course to learn. Child development, different plays, talking about babies who are this tiny months old. Talking about different types of toys kids play with, fine growth skills that kids learn, like can put shoes on themselves, can use knife and fork for eating at five years old, can hold a pen or a pencil the right way, four years old. Had to make a flower baby. I remember that. I had to make a flower baby and look after it. Oh my goodness. For two days. Oh my goodness. Oh, such good times learning that. And going to that class every day on Friday when I was in sixth year. So I did school in sixth year, but then on Fridays I went to college and just learned about childcare. It was really good. Thanks for watching, guys. This has been Danger Debs looking back at her school books that she found in her childhood room in Inverness. Oh my goodness, there were so many books to look at back from 1999 up to 2013. And after that, because some of them books were from college. I hope you liked it. Give it a thumbs up. Please comment below and tell me what books have you still got from school. Because there is a time when teachers ask you at the end of the year, what do you want to take home? Your own jotter? Your maths jotter? This big huge poster that I want to get rid of? What do you guys still have in your house from school? Tell me in the comments below. And also subscribe to my channel because I need to talk more about my school experience and show you off of some of my other books that I found in my childhood room and just some creative books in general so subscribe today to me Danger Debs who is the opposite of danger bye guys